Shifting focus to India, the Indian space agency ISRO has just announced the successful completion of the space docking experiment SpadeX. This is a highly sophisticated feat that only the space agencies from US, Russia, Europe and China have accomplished. And India is the fifth in this elite list. Space docking is the process of mechanically attaching two separate satellites that are flying in space. This entire process has to be done fully autonomously. After two closed docking attempts earlier this month, ISRO meticulously studied the data and finally the docking is a success. India launched the twin SpadeX satellites on December 30th aboard the PSLV rocket. The rocket lifted the two satellites 470 kilometers above the Earth. Each satellite weighs 200 kgs and carries multiple sensors and cameras. Over the last 12 days, the satellites have been moving closer to each other gradually. And this morning, ISRO has completed the docking. Docking technology is crucial for India's, space, India's future space missions. To understand the complexity of space docking, Beyond's principal correspondent Siddharth MP recently spoke to Mr. N. Shankaran, the director of ISRO's UR Rao Satellite Center. Take a look. Can you tell us, sir, how complicated this the satellites are traveling at 28,000 kilometers per hour and autonomously they'll have to dock? Correct. It is like you would have seen in uh, the movie Speed, how the two buses are going at 100 miles per hour together parallelly and you have to put a bridge and uh, transfer people. It is exactly like that, but only the speed is going to be at least another 2,000 times more. That is the difficulty in this work. But it is not impossible. People have already done it. We have developed our own technology. As far as docking is concerned, uh, this is very crucial for our future ambitions, right? Chandrayaan 4 requires docking. And as far as our Bharati Antarik space station is concerned, we need to assemble piece by piece, right? So tell us uh, what docking means for ISRO's future. As already pointed out, the, we require for all human space flights, uh, docking is an essential requirement. And any crewed flight to moon, it is essential. Uh, and any return flight from moon or mars anywhere it is essential so uh, in a nutshell other than earth observing and uh, communication satellites that are uh, regularly made by us till now remaining all other uh, space missions require docking as a technology so it's an enabling technology